Hello everyone! Today, I'm going to present my research paper entitled The Development of Data Acquisition on Periodic Attendance Record of the Faculty by yours truly. Introduction Colleges and universities faculty attendance were mostly monitored manually by a checker assigned by the Human Resource Department for a periodic class schedule as basis for the salary computations even if there were biometric finger scanning devices at the schools, colleges, and university entrance. The biometric data capturing did not include frequent checking of attendance of the faculty. Hence, the researcher had developed an RFID-based device installed near the classroom for easy access by the faculty. The faculty will log in and log, and log out every start and end of the class period. The HR department installed the host computer or server. It is equipped with MySQL database wherein each faculty uh, subject will be entered into the database at the beginning of each semester as a basis for salary every payoff. Conceptual framework. And this figure shows the setup of the study since most of the colleges and university consists of many colleges and departments. The device is installed in the whole campus near the classroom to quickly or conveniently utilize it to log in or log out device. Distances of every department are also considered in this study and computed based on the distance capacity of serial communication using RS-232 standard. Statement of the problem. The study aims to design and implement the device to acquire the class hour faculty attendance record of most schools, colleges, and universities anytime and in the right format. The study focused on developing a digital solution to solve problems in the manual logging in and log out and logging out processes. Specifically, the study seeks to answer the following questions. Number one, what is the convenient way of checking the attendance of the faculty? Number two, what is the imminent way of logging in and logging out in the faculty? Number three, how useful is this way of generating a faculty attendance report on the HR side? Significance of the study. This study is essential for most schools, colleges, and universities because it shows faculty whereabouts. The system can easily monitor absences. It implies fewer jobs in monitoring faculty attendance on the human resource department, schools, colleges, and universities. In addition, this study is used mainly by schools, colleges, and universities with the same problem as presented above might use in the schools bigger or smaller than the figure presented in the previous slide. Scope and limitations. This study is ideal for schools, colleges, and universities which have a remote location of acquiring the faculty's attendance. This system exclusively designs for a more significant number of employees but lesser monitoring personnel. This study cannot be utilized by other establishments aside from schools that uses periodic time recording checking or record checking or hourly log in and log out. However, one faculty can log in and log out without his presence or make it by one or anyone who brings his ID number. Personal commitment is required. Methodology. The method shown here is deductive because it is experimental based on plan, do, check, act criteria. And this figure shows the schema. Uh, in the figure shows the schema of the study. Plan. Designing RFID reader interface to microcontroller. RFID reader has many formats. The researcher must identify which will use the RFID reader. After having the RFID reader, the researcher created a microcontroller interface to the RFID module. Figure shows the schematic diagram of the system. As shown in this figure, 
the LCD, RFID reader, and the microcontroller connected together at the serial communication ports to the isolation circuit of another module. RS-232 controller amplifier isolation. Another important circuit connected to main controller is the isolation of RS-232 serial controller and amplifier. Isolation use optocoupler and bridge diode to avoid interferences. Spreading concepts. In the figure shown, a concept of spreading multiple serial ports to accommodate the whole composite up is part of the implementation and design. The concept based on the ring topology that all devices were connected, including the host computer. Power supply. Another important circuit is the power supply. Without this module, the system will not work. As shown in this figure, it consists of positive 5 volts, positive 12 volts with a regulated output that uses ICs or regulator IC. Do layouts for the main system board. All the circuit diagrams translated into functional layout as shown in this figure. Layout for the power supply. Shown in this figure is the power supply module layout. Check. The components are being placed in the system board then soldered carefully. The figure shows the placement of the parts both main board and the power supply. ACK, testing and implementation. In this stage of methodology, the researcher presented the output after the development. As shown in this figure, the RFID reader is now functional based on the desired output as presented in this paper. Host computer display. Finally, the host computer or server equipped with this software that totally automates the entire processes. It will show the current date and current time, ID number, name of the faculty, login date, login time, logout time, including the status. That's all of my paper presentation. Thank you for listening. Bye.